And we're back to learning Inkscape and this time I'm going to show you how to add a two color gradient to basically any object. We want to get around using the mesh tool, instead we are just creating a shape. Let me use a star or maybe I use a polygon. Let me make it five corners so it's a pentagon. Rotate it holding control. We're going to start with a black color. Now control D to copy it and I give it a white color and I size it down holding shift and control. So this method works for two color gradients and if you want to have for example red to black just make it red. I'm going to stick to white to black in this case. Then select it all control A extensions generate from path and use interpolation. Let me go down to eight steps and I check the live preview if a warning message pops up just confirm and you can see what this method does and if you increase the interpolation steps you're going to make it smoother. So these interpolation steps, they become so small that your eye will see it as a gradient. The method itself, so one or two doesn't make a difference here. Just keep the exponent to 0.0. .0. And at some point, when you go up with the interpolation steps, you can see that it becomes so smooth that we can work with it. So 100 is a good value for my size here. The object in center, and its size in relation to the object on the outside makes a difference as well. So let me size it down and I'll show you this again. So it's the exact same interpolation, but it's a different feel now. So if you want to make it smaller, maybe you'll have to adjust the interpolation steps and get a little bit upwards. Let me just use 150 here. So keep that in mind when you use this method. But the general process is always the same. So just use this interpolation on two objects of the same category and give them different colors and you have this blend effect due to the interpolation. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.